Hi, I'm uh, Peter Gould. So I'm the Senior Research Manager here at Reseath, uh, part of IOSFI. And what I'm going to talk a little bit about today is this mini vertical farm. So it's an off-the-shelf unit and it's uh, been bought basically for, to allow us to take it to different places and discuss vertical farming with the general public and, and, and schools and, and classes and things like that. The main benefits with this particular setup is involved in soil free growing. So we use only water and nutrients within the growing system. It uses particular lights, uh, these LED lights that are red and blue lighting to allow us to um, efficiently uh, allow the plants to create energy. This system is a vertical farm and it's based on hydroponics, which is growing our plants uh, without soil. Um, the bonus with this is it uses a lot less water um, than traditional farming and a lot less chemicals and therefore there's less waste um, and carbon footprint by growing in this particular way. This particular system you could have anywhere you wanted, you could have it placed within city centres and grow crops to feed the growing population that we have um, worldwide. This particular system we have here is a simplified system of what we have behind me, which is our big vertical farm. The way this works is we have the plants growing here in um, rock wool, which is basically like your insulation in, in the roof. And then what happens is the roots start to grow and they grow into the liquid media uh, in the bottom. And then for aeration, there's a little pump that just basically circulates the liquid within these little tanks. We also have the lights above here and, and a fan to distribute the energy and the heat uh, created by the LEDs. And then these, this lighting here uh, provides the plants with all the uh, light that it requires to grow. So if you're coming to RHS Tatton Flower Show, then please come and see us uh, at our particular stall and I'll be able to talk some more about our vertical farming system that I'm showing here and talk a lot more about farming and sustainability.